It's in poop and there's a list on the back door. It's not. I didn't take it down. I'm sorry. I just wanted a little bit of weed before I started. Okay. So uh, this is how it's going to go. The list has not changed. So please get ready for your first performance of the night. Please make some noise for Steve Baldwin. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, bro, how you doing? Yeah. Thursday night. Let's keep it going for drawers. Yeah. I was gonna do a bit last week uh, about Billy Graham, uh, but I figured I might ought to wait three days. Just kind of hedge my bets, make sure. <laughs> Guy lived 99 years, served the Lord for 99 years. You'd have think the Lord would let that odometer click over to triple digits. <laughs> Just give the man 100 years. My mother's 85. She's 85, but she's not that get up in the morning and do yoga 85. She's more like uh, failed nation. 85, she's like, uh, she's like Venezuela, 85. And uh, yeah, so uh, she doesn't drive anymore, so I had to take her to a, uh, uh, a party uh, for the grandchildren in Winston-Salem. That's a four hour drive. That's a four hour drive with a failed nation. And uh, so I, every once in a while I have an idea and I keep a pad and paper with me doing what I do. I, I write down stuff that I think is funny. Maybe not funny to you, but it's funny. I, it's going to turn into something. So as I'm driving along, I'm, I'm up on the steering wheel, and I'm writing some stuff, you know. She goes, what, 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 are, you, what are you doing there? Like, you're, you're writing some funny things. And I'm like, well, I, every time a funny idea comes to me, no matter what it is, Mom, I, you know, I write it down, and I store it away. Maybe, maybe later on it'll turn into something. Well, you, you know, uh, it'd be safer for the drive, and, and I, used to be, I used to be a secretary, but yeah, I used to be a secretary. I'll tell you what, you, I'll write it down. You just give me the pencil and the paper. I'll write it down for you. I'm like, well, you know, that actually makes sense. That'd be a good idea. It'd be a great idea. Let me, I give her the pencil, uh, the pen and the paper, and now she's sitting there like a Manchurian candidate, just <laughs> looking at me. I'm like, it doesn't happen like that, Mom. <laughs> got to come to me. Okay, hold on. So now I'm thinking, this is an opportunity. Because if you don't know me and my mother, we fuck with each other all the time. So now I'm riding along. I give it 15 minutes to let it kind of smooth out. I'm like, I got an idea, Mom. I got a great idea. Get the pen and the paper ready. You ready? And she goes, oh, yeah, I'm all set. I just write this down here. I'm like, pussy bread. <laughs> well. Wow. Yeah, it's two words, right? Yeah, yeah, it's two words. Pussy, bread. Yeah, when I heard you the first time, pussy, bread, pussy, okay, pussy, I don't see anything funny. Put, okay, put sweet in front of it. Sweet pussy bread. Okay, well, I, I put that in there. Hey, look, now, up ahead, there's a Cracker Barrel. Maybe we stop there for lunch, you know. But, well, that'd be great. But sweet. Swear to God, if when we get in there, if you start ordering sweet pussy bread, I'm just going to walk out. I'll walk out with not so much as a kiss my ass. And that's how I'm going to leave you guys tonight. Pussy bread and not so much as a kiss my ass. Y'all take care. My name's Steve Ball, and I appreciate you guys. Steve Ball, everybody. Steve Ball, That's how you start the show off. <laughs>